The Beaver Dam death investigation of Robert Hatchett is no longer a homicide. That according to the Beaver Dam Police Department. So what exactly happened? Coming up later on News 25, I sit down with his twin brother, William Hatchett, inside the Ohio County Detention Center. Hear his take coming up later in an exclusive interview on News 25. He couldn't swallow no more, so I would have to, you know, make soups and pour it down his throat, man, and set him up in the bed. And, you know, people don't know that I had to go through stuff like that. A dying twin brother is all William Hatchett says he had left. A preliminary autopsy today indicates no homicide. My brother passed on, um, you know, the 8th of January in my, in my arms. So... It's hard for me, man. William told Beaver Dam police over the weekend when serving a welfare check, Robert was with family in Dayton, Ohio. All the while, William says he buried his twin behind their home. We didn't have any money. So I thought the best thing for me to do was to bury him. William says after police came looking for his twin, he bought a Greyhound bus ticket for Lincoln, Nebraska. William says he has a childhood friend who lives there and was going to tell him. I decided to come back and um, turn myself in and just tell, tell the truth. William turned himself in Monday night and is charged with tampering with physical evidence. William says the tear tattoos on his face represent his mother who died of cancer and his sister who was killed by his father and then took his life. Another tear is coming. I've always been, you know, independent on my own. And I thought what I did was the right thing. And, um, you know, I apologize to anybody that, that thinks different. But until they, you know, until they've been in my shoes, then they can't, you know, they'll never understand. Never.